All right, welcome back to the channel. Today's daily challenge deals with uh, super or sports utility heroes. That's what it is. And I'm going to pick one of these. Let's grab this one. And we have to use it in any arcade. So I jumped in here. It said we had a minute 31 until it started, and it just started. So. Oh, I still have a manual. Okay. Jump through the target. So this, so this is an air one, which. Right now we're jumping into Bullseye. I'm kind of late to the game, I guess. Which is weird. Where is it? Does it say where it is? Where is the Bullseye I need to hit? So, the, uh... The driving line is telling me where to go. But it just seems like I'm just driving forever to get there. So I think just using this, I don't think complete. Let's look, let's go look real quick. I know we're kind of. Oh, it says complete. Oh, complete any. Uh, okay. Well, this one's gonna be tough. Let's we'll see what happens. We literally have zero points. I must be the only one playing. I had to drive the entire. I don't know, miles to get here. So we can start doing these. I might be able to do it myself. Alright, so there it is. So on these, you just need to... Kind of follow the pattern, alright? So I already saw the other jump. So we're going to go through this one. Okay, bullseye. Nice. You don't want to go like too fast because too fast is another good thing. I don't remember playing here with this. This is this is new. I like this. Bullseye. Thank you very much. And you just kind of go from one to the next. You've probably seen me play this. You probably played it yourself. But this is the daily challenge today. Bullseye. Oh, one more. We only need 250, I think. We just need 4,000 here. I think that was a bullseye. We're going to count it. Alright, so... Got to get to the skills area, which is over there. What kind of skills are we doing? Air skills, of course, because it's an air horizon arcade. Ooh, I just got a sweet wheelie. Alright. So the little ones, just like that... I don't, yeah, that counted. Okay, cool. You don't need to get huge ones like that. You just need a bunch of little ones. That's how we're going to win this. Three. I don't know what we need. Total. We're not getting anything. This is crazy. Okay. So I gotta, I gotta do it a little bit different. There was a little bit. There was a little bit. There's a huge one. There's 10. It looks like we're a little bit past halfway with 10, so. Oh, I didn't get that skill. Dang. It's rough. Okay. We're just gonna keep going. After this, I also have to do yesterday's, which is buff horses, street race, and a Mustang. So stay tuned for that. I don't know what else. We're in the second one, so we're doing okay. I wish I had somebody else here to help me. Nobody's in this one with me. I just kind of jumped onto Forza today, and this is what we want, man. Sometimes I don't like waiting for an arcade to pop up, because it can take a long time. At least it seems. There's 13, 14, I kind of just keep going back and forth, 15. Second one there, 18. There we go, okay. Danger sign, there's one over here. Which one are they talking about? I'm just gonna skip all those roads because they're not necessary. Um, definitely gonna take two of these from me. We'll see. 
I'm not going to be able to complete the entire thing in one jump. Especially not with this. But it's going to take a while to get back up. 340. Maybe. Maybe I get the whole thing. 1429. Look at this. Oh, okay. Two. Now, I need to get back up there and do one just as good in 3 minutes and 30 seconds. Wow. And not have it fail. Oh, that was terrible. I lost all my momentum. This thing has rally tires because I love it on asphalt. It drifts very well. Not like, you know, you're going to go out and use it in a drift zone, but you can really sling it around. It slides. It's fun. I do recommend this. You can go, you can jump it backwards and it'll give you more, more points. So watch this. So 138 feet to add to that. I think I have time. I definitely have the time. So we're going to take it back to where we think we can get at least a thousand. I don't know what the specifics are. I think it's over probably 2,300, just guessing, in total. So maybe like a good 800 would get it. 1,000? Yeah, we got it. There it is. So this should be our daily challenge. This should be completed. There we go. So what we need to do today, I know I kind of jumped into that really quick, but utility player complete any horizon arcade in a sports utility heroes vehicle all right so i did that now we need to win a street racing event in any mustang so i'm kind of cleaning up you know what i was supposed to do yesterday but we had an event filled day yesterday so any mustang uh we're gonna go by manufacturer and then skip over to ford Hmm, interesting. I don't want to use my C one because it's just so slow. I wish you could group by maybe some of the the larger group of vehicles like Mustangs, Camaros. There's a lot of them. I really don't know what to do here. Definitely don't want to take that out. I would get destroyed. Um... What did I use the other day? It's the Formula D one, right? Where's that? Did I skip it? I'm probably dumb. No, they all look different now because I know which one I should use. All right, so there's the Mustang I used the other day, and it was absolutely horrible. I tried to make it good. I'm going to use this one. Nice A800, but very capable. I've used it before in these situations all right so now to find a street race go to the map um just kind of the first one i see there we go fine 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 i don't know if you guys know but if you have watched the channel before you've heard me talk about uh a big creator in the forza horizon 5 space and that is don juan song he has a lot of um creations whether it's tunes which i think his tunes are like on another level uh he has a lot of liveries that he puts a lot of time into uh he does youtube videos as well um also what else there's something else oh and he makes like event labs you know and, and challenge cards and things like that but he came out yesterday and absolutely blasted forza horizon 5 on twitter basically saying he's kind of done with it for now and it might even be dead and i was like dang tell me how you really feel now i don't feel that way i feel like it's it's kind of stale i wish the dlc was coming out sooner um i'm keeping it alive with this festival playlist stuff i think it's pretty fresh but i think there is some truth in what he's saying um there's definitely some if you look at the leaderboards that's another thing he does he has like uh you know lap times and stuff he's trying to be competitive i think he had one that was a world record and he said they were they were erasing those, you know. And I'm like, man, that would suck. Imagine that you like pour your heart and her heart and soul into something, try to get a really good time, and they take it away. But it kind of just seems like it's a mess, and we need somebody to, to fix it. Is the thing. But in in this game's development cycle, 
I don't think they're working on it anymore, you know? Now it's just out there trying to get all the money it can. There's like a couple guys that that sweep still around, you know what I mean? Of course the festival playlist people, you know. But not like when a game's launching or when a game's, you know, getting developed. So, but he said he's going to roll on to Need for Speed Unbound. Now, I've been seeing a lot of stuff as far as customization and, and whatever. So, it looks good. I think it's going to be incredibly ricey. Ooh, big turn. I think it's going to be very ricey. Um, we'll have to see. I don't know if they're going to have any name brand uh, parts, body kits, whatever. I know they have some vehicles. It's hilarious to me. Um, I've spoke about this before on here, but Toyota said this was Toyota um, out of the UK, but that was their account. On Twitter. But they said they are not going to participate in the game that glorifies street racing. And then I'm like, uh... Have you played Forza? <laughs> I mean, look what I'm doing right now. I could just as easily go get any Toyota. Not that I want to do that and call their bluff and make them take their cars out of the game. Plus, they already probably signed stuff, whatever. But I just thought that is such like a virtue signaling kind of thing. Like, it's a game, man. You know? I get it why manufacturers won't be in a game like GTA. You know, there's violence. There's craziness. There's blood murder like you know yeah it's, it's wild but it's not really street racing you know it's not like i don't think kids are going to go out and street race because of need for speed i think if somebody wants to race they're going to race you know i seen a guy this is hilarious to me we had a we had a car meet not too long ago it was like uh it was like a cruise it's like but it's a, it's a pretty big event for our area and some guy had a Turbo Civic, okay, sedan. Somehow rolled it by the time we, we left and then we came back a little bit later on to see what things were still going on, kind of cruised through again. And uh, there we go. Daily challenge complete from yesterday. But we show up and there's all these fire trucks in England. This car flipped over. I'm like, that's crazy. But that night earlier when we were there, there was a guy in a Tesla. It was a, I think it was a Model 3. No. What's the little one? Yeah, the, the three, I think. Because the S is a little bit bigger. Yeah. So we had a Model 3, and he was just some young guy, and he was ripping on it. I mean, going crazy. And if people are already doing that in electric cars, and I've seen some of the people like on YouTube and stuff with their Tesla Plaids going a million bajillion miles an hour from a, from a stoplight. I mean, it doesn't even look real. But, you know... There's no Tesla in this game. Nobody's on here doing that, but those people are doing it. They're going to do it regardless. So, whatever. So, we've done the daily challenges that we can do. We have three seasonal championships and another one, and I'm done. That's it, right? That's everything. That's crazy. All we have left is seasonal championships after yesterday. If you haven't watched yesterday's videos, let me tell you. I did some crazy stuff in there. We had... Let me, let me just go over this if you guys haven't seen... Um, this here, this drift zone, I'll go to it. My controller is being crazy. One million points. My personal best before this was like 800,000. Okay. So I don't know if you saw my personal best there, but definitely go try to check that out. And then as I was like driving around doing stuff, whatever, there was another one. This speed zone was, was a little tough. Um, this one was pretty high as well as far as speed that was required. But the collectibles. Now I heard tail when I got on yesterday that um, let me see if I can cruise out to the highway, the motorway. I'm sorry, that's what they call it. But all the donuts were out there, and they said one was on the power line. Okay, so for me yesterday the donuts were not there. Let's go see if I can find the donut again. And in yesterday's video, I did collect the power line donut. If you want to check that out. It was in the uh, weekly challenge video, but I've already gotten all these. You need to get ten of them. They respawn. You don't have. They're not specific, you know. But I wanted to show you guys where where the big boy was at. I just like hitting them. I, t I told you guys 
before the season or yeah before the season started I was just gonna hit them because I think it's hilarious I wish there was more a couple of the the challenge cards I made the, the one specifically just has a bunch of uh, beach balls that you can jump into and that's that's fun to me okay where is this sucker I think it's a good ways out we're going 167 I think you can get it going like 130 I'm gonna watch my time here I wish they were closer to the road I don't want to hit the guardrail I hit that and didn't hit the guardrail that was nice there's another one I was just cruising out through here and I was like oh what's that I think it's that one right there no wrong side of the road my fault right there right there is it up there Ooh. it's gone there it is okay you see it there guys all right, so I'm going to go try and get that. I'll show you what I did. Now, I was not in this car. So I'm going to try a different car. But my Koenigsegg Jesko. <laughs> Jesko, that's a mouthful. Uh, All-wheel drive, rally suspension. This thing has rally suspension, I think. So 130 was needed. I'm not there yet. Let's we'll see. Right through here and up. And that's how you get it. Close, 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 close. I need to not. Oh, so close. Wish you could get a good, a good view. I gotta resume, so I gotta move it. Oh man, it's really pushing me to the left. How do I do this? I guess I go over even further. Did I get it? Oh my gosh, guys. Did you see that? That, that was close, wasn't it? <laughs> I can't believe that. I can't believe it. Okay. Get it. Get it. There you go. Second time. Second day in a row. That's pretty easy, actually. It's fun. I like it. Um, but that's going to do it for today. Let me see what tomorrow's daily challenge is. Hot shot, earn a total of 150 mile per hour across speed zones in any hot hatch. Well, that's doable. Earn a trading paint skill in Juan de Juato. Easy. Play an event blueprint. Easy. Drive five miles in Horizon Open. Easy. Win a cross country event in any C class vehicle. Okay, so nothing challenging. Nothing. It's smooth sailing. We're going to get those. Um, I am two points away from the second reward car, the Ferrari. Let's look at uh, the winter season. So we have the Ford Wagon. Uh, when I look at that, I don't really feel like it's going to be a, a good racer. There's not really any challenges where you just cruise around. But look at this weekly challenge, the Acura Integra Type R. Now, doesn't get any better than that. These cars are very overhyped. Now, they're... They're good. They're amazing. But I don't think they should have given them uh, limited numbers. But that's what everybody does nowadays, and it sucks. Like the brand new Civic Type R, I'd love to have one. If I get it for sticker, even that's a little high, but, you know, with inflation, whatever. But with these market adjustments, you know, screw you. I'm not paying $15,000 just because. It's not going to happen. If we all say that, then it's not going to happen. But whatever. Um, like somebody said, if you add $15,000 to an already high sticker price of like $45,000, you know, you're at $60,000 car territory. You can get a better car for the same money. So why? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Uh, but we're going to have that. Of course, the dailies. we got the Bugatti EB110, whatever that thing is. Um, another trial. Why are they all called bumper to bumper? I don't know. Uh... It shows the Woody for a speed trap. That's weird because it's a reward car, so it's not going to be a reward there. But three seasonal championships, 
treasure hunt. I like that. Got the Miata there. It says money pit. I need to get mine and put a put that body kit on there. Photo challenge, of course, and then eliminator, danger sign, blah 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 blah. So I'm not gonna go to spring. We're gonna look forward to just winter because that's um I mean today's only Friday, that's still five days away. But all we have left is some seasonal championships and daily challenges until then. But I've been rambling long enough. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, I am going to try and play Need for Speed, I think, when it comes out. I'm going to look at it. I'm going to see what other people are playing. Um, Car X, if you've ever heard of that. Car X Drift. I think it's on Xbox. But it's supposed to be coming out Car X Street for PC. So it's not just drifting. It's actually like, you know, it has a map and whatever. I don't know. But I'm thinking about changing things up a little bit. I'm still going to be doing the same Forza content. I'm going to try to do it every day. But I want to bring something new and fresh to the channel. Um, like I said, I think I think Forza, I'm going to admit it. I'm a big Forza fanboy. But um, I, feel, I feel like it's a little stale right now. And as much as I play it, as much as I show it off, uh, I do want to share some other stuff with you guys so hopefully something good's coming out it's that time of year getting close to christmas games are going to be releasing so that's it for me and i'll see you guys in the next one later